Hey, hair nerds, what's happening? I'm coming at you live. This is Matt Swinney, and I'm coming at you from the first Lanza Healing Center. And I just want to talk to you a little bit about Lanza Healing Hair Care because it's going to be in the next Hair Nerd Mystery Box. So I can't tell you this, what the surprise product is, but I can tell you that it's going to be awesome and that you're going to be love it. And it's going to be available on thehairnerds.com. So you might want to check it out. It's going to be pretty cool. But anyway, like I said, my name is Matt Swinney. I'm the Global Creative Director with Lanza. And right now we're hanging out at my salon in Minneapolis, Minnesota. You guys all know what the holidays are like uh, at the hair salon. It's pretty crazy. So we've got people going nuts. There's a whole lot more I'll show you in just a little bit. But I just wanted to get a little bit hair nerdy with you because that's why we are part of the hair nerd family because we all love what we do um, we just got finished shooting Naha so it was pretty exciting we just had a crazy week here in Minneapolis shooting uh, multiple collections for Naha and for behind the chair this year uh, oh that's my dad say hi dad hi that's my dad right there Richard Swain he works here he's 77 years old and he works with all of us what he calls kids and I swear it keeps him young and keeps him alive he's been doing hair for in the neighborhood of like 44 years and the one thing that he does is he walks through the salon every night and says goodbye to every single person that works here it's pretty fantastic um, if you guys don't have a mentor like that I highly recommend that you get one because he's been been great for me in my life but yeah you guys can see one of the entries from last year we got these entries on the wall from last year's Naha. Uh -huh. They look pretty amazing. So the salon itself has got 16 foot ceiling, so you can tell these guys are uh, of quite a grandiose scale. What's up, Amy? How you doing? Um, yeah, so we shot for a uh, salon team. It was pretty exciting. We want to see more Papa Swinney. He left. He left. He's 77. He's, you know, he's getting old and it's snowing in Minnesota, so he's got to get home safe. But anytime you want to talk to him, you know, just shoot me a DM on Instagram and I can, uh, I can have him answer any questions for you. He's a good guy. I actually worked for him for uh, five years and so did the other two owners here. We all worked together. And yeah, so we just shot for Salon Team for Naha and I shot a collection. Um, I'm not going to tell you what it's for though. And then we got Mark Dolan here. He's also been a Naha finalist. It's this guy right there. Happens to be my best friend as well. He shot a collection. There's a girl here, Gina Watson, shot a collection. And uh, Michael Dahl shot a collection. So, pretty exciting week. Um, I don't know if you guys, you know, are like to shoot for Naha or if you just look at it for inspiration. But I can highly recommend that getting yourself behind the camera, even if it's not something you strive to do uh, in, a, in a competition setting, really does change the way you look at hair behind the chair you know and i think it's really important and it kind of like adds to your uh hair nerdity if that's a word nerdity yeah makes you a little more hair nerdy um yeah so we're gonna take you a little walk around the slime because i want to show you guys something really cool we've got this really great product coming out uh, for lanza and i just want to show you guys how it works because i think you guys would be truly uh, excited when this hits the shelves. Um, it's a new styling product, but as we walk through here, I'm going to show you guys a little bit of the. Oh, there's some madness happening. You can see how it says Lanza Healing Center. There's my client getting the shampoo. More clients. Anyway, so I'm grabbing this product right now. That I want to show you. It's called the Air Paste. You guys see it right here? This product is new from Lanza. I'm pretty excited about this. We use this a lot in our shoot. You know, um, people think of an Air Paste or a pasty type product and they think of it only for short hair, but we used it for long hair too. And when the photos come out that I did, you'll see um, I did this really cool kind of uh, new version mullet and we use the Air Paste. And just watch how this comes out. I don't want to shoot the phone though. See that? So you get a paste in like a really light mist, which is super fantastic. I think it's really important that when you put product on the hair, you know, it's like evenly, right, evenly dispersed. So it comes out like that and just that really fine mist gives you 
a lot of nice grip, but not um, not heavy. And I think that that's really important when you're when you're dealing with products uh, like this. And that's one of the great things that I love about Lanza anyway, is that it's really hard to like weigh down the hair with our products. Our products definitely make the hair healthy, but you won't find anything that just kind of like sits on top. Everything starts to work from the inside of the hair out and really kind of like gives you, um, well, like I said, gives you healthier hair, but also gives you the hold and the performance that you're really trying to achieve when you're looking for a styling product. So let's get a little hair nerdy. It's the holidays, right guys? And we're all working hard and we're all working like crazy. Um, one thing that we like to do here uh, in for uh, Evolution in Minneapolis is that we do we do give backs, right? Like it's really important as hairdressers in this community to just give back to your community, and it really helps grow your business behind the chair. We connected ourselves with a company with a group called an organization organization called Best Christmas Ever. But anything you can do in your community as hairdressers, we are lucky enough to touch people on a daily basis, right? So there's not many jobs in the world where someone actually gets to put their hands on someone else and it's, and it's accepted and it's comfortable, you know, and it's actually uh, welcomed because, because we're providing a service for them that's calming and making them feel better. So holiday give back, great idea. If you guys are trying to get your books kind of built up for the holiday season, I gotta tell you, take an extra 10 minutes at the end of the night to do some sort of style for your clients for these holiday parties, right? It doesn't take a long time. I've got a cool ponytail on my Instagram feed. It's matt.swinney. Um, but you could do, I've got actually like three different styles that are super fast, super easy. And if you take that extra 10 minutes or 15 minutes, on just a couple of your clients that night before they go to these holiday parties, you're really going to notice your books start to soar, right? You're going to really build, start to build that clientele because one thing that helped me really build my business and now like for example at this point, like I have no appointments on my schedule until February. So I'm booked all the way through February and I work in the salon just like you all. So I'm here from Monday to Friday. I don't work Saturdays because I've been in the biz for 20 years and I travel a lot, but still it's five days a week typically start at 9 and at 10 so you're looking at a 13 hour day uh, with an appointment booked every half hour so um, but how I built my business was I would take an extra 10 minutes right for those last two clients or whatever who I knew were gonna go out and I knew were gonna talk to me and I wouldn't just curl the hair I wouldn't just flat iron the hair around brush it like I would do something a little tricky and if you need help finding the tricks they're all over the internet. Hair nerds post them all the time. The amazing stylists doing quick little tips, tricks, and techniques to help you up on the chair. But take that extra 10 minutes, do some kind of cool style on that client, and what you're gonna notice is, is that when they go out to their holiday party or their happy hour or their, you know, whatever they're doing with their girlfriends, we all know there's one thing, no matter where you live in the world or where you live in the country, that women do when they go out. Talk, right? They talk. They talk, talk, talk. And what they're going to be talking about is, oh, you know, hey, Julie, your hair looks so cool. Like, what? How did you do that? You know, how did you do that ponytail? Oh, well, Matt did it for me. He he normally just curls my hair or whatever, but he told me he'd give me an extra ten minutes to do something cool for my part for the party tonight, and that's what he did for me. And so what will end up happening is they'll start saying to themselves, right? Like, well, oh, my stylist Mark doesn't do that for me, right? So maybe I should give Matt a try because this looks really cute. And that's how I built my business in a city with some of the best hairdressers in the country. You know, Minneapolis is a hotbed of hairdressers, right? Uh, one of the people that shot last week with uh, my good buddy Richard Monsieur was the photographer that I used for Naha was Whitney Vermeer, right? We all know how talented that lady is. She had a great year last year and just a wonderful person on top of it. But, you know, you can, Minneapolis is a hotbed of talent for hairdressers. And so you really have to do little things to set yourself apart um, from everybody else. And so that's something that you might want to you might want to try um, behind the chair. Just, I've got three little videos on mine. I know the hair nerds post stuff all the time, and there's tons of sources on the internet for you, just for a quick little pony or a quick little bun or a quick little twist or something like that can really, um, really benefit your client and benefit yourself behind the chair. Because this is the season about styling hair, right? I see, I travel all over the world. I'm lucky enough to meet like 
crazy cool, great stylists everywhere I go. And I can tell you, I've seen a lot of stylists who can cut a lot of hair, and I've seen a lot of stylists who can color a lot of hair, but the ones that typically are the busiest are the ones that can style the hair, right? Because that's what people see when they walk out the door. I always tell my people that work at the salon, your client should be singing her theme song when she leaves the salon, right? I had this client, Anna Williams, once, and she's mama too, uh, husband, husband worked, so she had, and she worked too, so she had the job, the kids, the house, the groceries, because we all know the husbands are lazy a little bit sometimes on that stuff. So she was doing everything. And she sat down in my chair one day and she told me, you know, and she's, she's biracial, so her hair, I have to uh, press her hair out and then I'll curl it. And she told me, she goes, really, every time I leave here, all I think about is the song, Who's That Lady? And so it got me thinking, and I was like, who's that lady? Well, why do you think that? She goes, because that's my theme song, Matt. That's what I sing when I feel like I'm looking good. And so that became my motto, right? Like everyone who walks out of a salon should be singing their theme song inside their head. So I know you all got a theme song inside your head. Do you sing it when you leave the salon is the question, you know? Or are you helping your clients kind of invoke or, or, or see their their theme song happen. So, yeah, so there's a little trip around the salon to see what we're all about. And little tips and tricks for the holidays. Um, like I said, you know, for, uh, I'm just honored that the Hair Nerds gave me a minute, on, a minute of time on their Facebook feed to talk to you guys about Lanza and what's coming up. And remember, this mystery box is gonna be available at hairnerds.com. And I'm telling you, you won't be disappointed. It's going to be a very, very cool gift inside there. And I just want to thank the Hair Nerds for consistently putting out, you know, dope stuff for our dope industry and really being, you know, some nice leading ladies to, uh, to help our industry grow and be seen all over the world. So, guys, Matt Swinney, you guys know what it's like. It's the holidays. I've got two clients waiting. I got one under the dryer over there. You see her? Yeah, on her phone. So I'm gonna go back to work. I gotta go take care of some hair. But listen, if you have any questions, direct message me on Instagram. Any lots of questions, any hair questions, any photo shoot questions, any life questions. I'm there for all of you. I appreciate you, Matt Swinney. Matt.swinney. And thanks a lot, hair nerds. Check out that mystery box, hairnerds.com.